What's up guys, John from Titan here, and I want to talk about another big question that I get. It is, John, how much or how many over-the-counter supplements or oral supplementation should I do? Um, and I respond back with, hey, listen, what are you deficient in or what are you trying to do to try to figure out, you know, what you really should be doing. But the fact is, is a lot of people overdo it a lot of the time on oral supplementation or over-the-counter supplements. They really don't know what these things do to benefit them. They have no idea what's really in these things. And they don't look at the labels like they should or the ingredients. Or they have to deal with that asterisk and the little proprietary blend that we all see. So quality over quantity in all shapes and forms and everything you do in life. It's all about quality because you can get a, a whole bunch of nothing and it's really not going to have any value to you. Okay, So we want to look at what we're intaking in our body. So it's always good to supplement different things. Not just for example, vitamins and amino acids. And everybody says, listen, you can get vitamins and amino acids from nutrition. So it's real simple to do, right? It sounds real simple, but it really isn't that simple. You'd almost have to be a perfect eater and eating all day long. Plus, let's not forget about our food sources, like the micronutrient content that we really get in some of these different food sources. Are we really getting the micronutrients and things that we really need to have our body properly run. And I'm telling you, in most cases, it doesn't do it. And vitamin D is a good example. A lot of people are vitamin D deficient. And here in Florida, I'm here, we get the sun all day. I've got a nice tan. I usually go out there and try to get at least 15 minutes a day. But during the week, I get a lot more. But I'm still vitamin D deficient. And a lot of people are in this category. Um, it's because our body doesn't absorb or, or process it properly anymore. So we have to supplement these different things. And vitamin D is just a perfect example because here at Titan Medical Center, we blood test and usually eight out of 10 people are vitamin D deficient or very low in vitamin D. And at that point, when you're low in vitamin D or deficient, it can cause a lot of different health problems, okay? Or you're not running at optimal or proper levels in your body like it should. So with these different things, make sure you guys know what you guys should be supplementing and don't overdo it. The reason you don't want to overdo it is you're taking all these different things in orally. If you're taking all these different things orally, I see like the, the pill challenge where people are swallowing 100 pills at a time. It's like, listen, your body has to break that down. And those ingredients in those pills or capsules or over-the-counter oral supplementation can cause damage to your liver because your liver has to process everything that runs through your body. Okay, it's like the filter for your body. And you might be putting a lot of stress on that and other organs in your body. So make sure you guys are educated on these things that you need to take in. Don't overdo it, okay? More is not always better, okay? So remember that. And quality over quantity. That's why me, I prefer the injectable vitamin amino acids. It's very simple, very easy. It doesn't have to run through my liver. It doesn't have to process through my gut. It's in. I know what I got. I'm running great levels because I can blood test and see. And it's just way more efficient and effective. So if you guys want to know more tips and tricks like these or have more questions you want to ask me, please DM us. If you guys want to get it on our injectable vitamin amino acid therapies, it's real simple and easy. Just call or text us at 727-389-3220. I appreciate you guys. Stay healthy and stay tight and strong.